ni sambola vinaka na yadangu ko rowina au marama uh, ni New Zealand au iavulai ki nukumbalavu na tumbungu ko andi timumu ki nukumbalavu um, na nongu matanitu ko tovata na nongu yasana ko the Crown Rove na nongu tikina ko savu savu na nongu yavusa ko savu savu na nongu koro ko nukumbalavu na nongu uh, matangali ko valelevu na nongu itokatoka ko valani lawa na nongu itutu vakavanua ni turanga na nongu ko ika na nonga na nongo man, manu manu na mbelo na nongo kau na vesi vinaka vakalevu um that is my Fijian vakambola and um it is an honor and a privilege to honor my um grandmother Andi Timumu who brought me up in New Zealand and to honour my ancestors from Nukumbalavu, Savisavu, the Count Rove, Vanu Levu, Fiji Islands. The first piece that I actually created was the um, Domoni Davoi, which I call the calling, and I used that, um, I carved that out of Omaru stone. Um, that was inspired through um, the traditional calling of a welcoming and um, so, and I also used the Ndavui shell, which is the conch shell, which is used for very important events for bringing people together. And it welcomes everybody um, to look at the artworks and be blessed while you are looking at them. Um, my clay tamboa that I have created is based upon the question of asking people um, about our most highly prized possession in Fiji that we use for apologies, for weddings, for birthdays, for births, and also it was used pre-European for trading. I used a lot of the trading materials, like the clay, the coconuts in it, which we call the mangi mangi, and also today's denomination of um, use of the money. The coins that are actually on the coconuts in it have got the other uh, 20 cent Fijian coin which depicts the tambour on it. So my context that I was trying to get across and ask people is why is such a highly prized taonga of um, Fijian heritage um, put on such a low denomination of coin. The glass piece that I have done, um, I actually wanted to incorporate something traditional with something contemporary. I actually was looking through a book called Pacific Tapa and I didn't realise that a lot of the Masi in there and the Tapa actually are held in the Auckland Museum which was a blessing and I actually saw this piece that is hanging here, the Masi Mbolombola which is from my province of the Kaunrove. Um, so that inspired me to create a contemporary design of um, in relation to a traditional depiction. And um, it was interesting when I actually came down to the vault um, with the Marcy cloths, this actual piece was lying on the table, so I thought straight away it must have meant to be.